Hello guys, welcome back to another video, and today we are going to be doing um, the second part to the islands tutorial. And um, let's just do one thing real quick. Uh, on the spawn location, let's get, let's actually make it locked. And now we won't actually have to see it. Locked ba basically just means um, you can't like touch it in the um, in the game, so. Like it's right here, but I can't grab it or anything. So that'll just be a little bit help. That'll just be a little bit more helpful and stuff. So yeah. So let's get right into this. So the first thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna do a few. Actually, we have to do one thing first. So we have to add a screen UI. Let's name it Build a um, Frame. Uh, hmm. What should the size be? So it should be like maybe a hundred fifty by three fifty. Oh, that's two forty. Uh huh. Okay, three fifty, and that looks pretty good. And uh, we can add a text label I think we know not text label text button scale that in and hmm what should it be like yeah yeah that's pretty good that's fine for now at least then we can name this uh, dirt because that's our first one that we're gonna make and we just need to change the text to dirt. Oops, dirt. And anything else, text scaled. And that's good. Now we can add a, another text label under it, I think. Like right there. That says how much you have of it. Um, And I guess it should be amount and wait no should do like one x like that then we can do text scaled okay that looks good at least for now let's just keep it like that because that looks fine and we can just add a script into here and a script into here oh also they're local not a uh, server so um for this one it will be, hmm, what should we do it as? Hmm. So what we have to say, I'm thinking right now, I forgot. Um, hmm, I don't know if we need a script there. Cause don't we, yeah, we should only need it for the amount. So, oh wait, no, 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 need, um, Script dot parent dot mouse button one click connect connect function and we're gonna say um uh oh wait right here we're going to add a um object value and let's name it block did I name that correctly? Oh, no, I did not. Okay. Block. And we're going to say script.parent. script.parent. parent. parent. block. value is equal to script.parent. Okay. Now that we have that. What we can say is, um, we can just set this to default dirt. So, in replicated storage, wait, no, 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 what am I doing? I mean to set it to the default as dirt, so, oh, oh my gosh, okay. Default, oh my gosh, why am I doing this? Oh my gosh, this is so horrible. I forgot how to do Roblox Studio. That's horrible. Um, but, that looks good. Also, this should be a scrolling frame. Then we can just resize it the same as we did. So, it's 100 by 
250. You know, 350. Yeah. Oh, and we said 150 here. Oh, not 50. 150. Oh my gosh, I'm losing my mind, guys. Okay. And now we can just transfer this into here and get rid of the frame. And we can also just get rid of the scrolling thing by just doing scroll bar thickness zero and scroll bar image transparency one. Okay, so now that it's gone and it looks a lot better, um, what we can say is, so we're gonna have a couple of things. We're gonna, let's add another one that's, um, uh, let's do wood. Let's do wood. Yeah, wood. Okay. And the na the text is going to be wood, of course. And, um, in the, oh, wait, we forgot to set, um, like this. So, hmm. I'm not sure what the amount should be. We can just, yeah, let's uh, edit that later. We can just get rid of these for now. We won't have anything in that. It'll just be one for now. But what we can do is inside here, we can add a, what's it called? <laughs> um, a UI grid layout. Uh, no, that does not look good. Um, hmm. Cell padding zero by zero by zero by zero. Oh my gosh, what is that? Um, 150 and 100. Yeah, okay, that's good. Uh, we need a little bit of cell padding. Five? Wait, no, 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 not in that direction. We don't need any cell padding in that direction. But we do need some cell padding in this direction. 10, 20, 25, 30. Wait, how big is the amount? Size is 30. Okay, so I just needed that. Okay. There we go. So now that looks perfectly fine. And we can also just add a little bit more. Also, I'll change this. It won't be like this in the future. We'll make it so that it's actually an inventory. But for now, this look, this is fine because, well, it, it works. So that's all you need to know. If it works, then it's good. And it's in scrolling canvas size two, wouldn't it be like a oh, hundred million? Yeah, so I'm just scroll forever. Yeah, I'm gonna scroll forever now because I did a hundred million. Also, with my auto scroll mouse, it'll just go zoom zoom. Oh, wait. No, it's not on the thing. Okay, there we go. No, get me back. I need to turn off my auto scroll. Okay, there we go. Wait, <laughs> wait, where's Earth? Where is Earth? Come back, Earth. Wait, I, I seriously don't know where Earth is. Here we go, okay. Also, if you don't know what I just did, I clicked on this and clicked F, F to focus. Because if you're like over here, you can click F on a block and then it'll focus on it, so yeah. Just as a little tip, if you guys, if that ever happens to you, which it probably will never happen to you. Also, what happened here? Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, I should probably, uh, oh my gosh, why did I do this? Okay. Zero by zero. Okay. There we go. Now the camera's position is there. Now that this works, uh, we can just actually start coding. So in here, we can go into the local script like we usually do and we can just in here um it's going to be a little bit different we're going to do find first child and this is going to be long 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 player oops okay that's oh my gosh why did i do this okay player dot player gui oops dot what do i call it build 
build dot um yeah build dot block dot value and uh we also just need to do dot name and then um that should actually be good and now I can do some stuff with the with this function right here because it's not that great right now um but we can fix it so what we'll say is um local block is equal to and then we can just copy this because it's an easy little thing to do and we can also just give it the block and we have a couple of other things to do um before we can actually move on to the script we have to um before we do the while like set its position the ghost position uh we have to um make sure that it actually like changes the block when you click on the um and you click on one of them so we're gonna say um player dot player wait no i think we can just copy it right and then we can wait no 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 we cannot copy it we have to say we actually have to do it. okay player dot player gui because i was thinking about like pasting the um this but then i realized that it was all the way over here and i didn't want to have to like get rid of all that stuff so we can just write it manually player gui dot build dot block dot value oops dot name and wait no 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 dot value i think that's what you do uh i don't think you do dot value i think you just do um dot changed connect function oops okay and um now we're just going to do a couple of things object destroy because we don't care about that object anymore and object equals nil because we also don't care about it again and also because we don't want the game to break or whatever and oh wait right here i need to do clone i just forgot about that um and now we can just copy this actually wait yeah we can copy that and wait no no no, no. i think we can just yeah we can just copy this whole thing then paste it yeah that should be everything that we need and um now that we're done with that we can go into the script and change a couple of things first we need to add block into there because that's important and um here instead of this we're going to say um also wait no block is just block right yeah block should just be block and now we can say block is equal to block clone and um uh what's it block dot player dot value is equal to um player dot name oops because we forgot that <laughs> i just realized that and um here we should probably actually make this all into one thing let's group it wait no 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 let's not group it control z um let's make it let's put it into a folder yeah okay folder same this island yeah that sounds cool and put it into island and in here we can just say workspace dot island and that should actually work so we can test it now oh wait no 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 we didn't actually make the wood um let's go into here we can duplicate that go into root oh, wait oh my gosh we forgot a couple of things so we need to add a string value and also a string value here name these player basically this is just saying uh, what player actually made this and um yeah so 
now in this dirt object thing uh, we can name it wood and here we can um, let's, we actually have to bring it into the workspace okay so um, we can also move it a bit there we go I should also probably put it to four stats okay a lot of, I'm getting sidetracked here okay so um on root we can just say hmm to put it to wood is there like a wood a uh, wood 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 planks yeah it's wood planks because what 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 would wood would look like oh that looks horrible we need wood planks bring in the wood planks that looks good okay yeah that looks a lot better and now that we have that we can just yeah, what that looks so. Hmm. Should we then call it wood planks? Eh, it's good for now. Um. Then we can just put it to a nice color. Not sure what that nice color would be though. Is it like a orangish color? Yeah, it has to be an orangish color. It can't be burnt sienna. But it could. Uh, I'm just like running through them quickly. I'm just trying to find the right one. Oh my gosh, this is so hard to find the right one. Well, we at least know that it needs to be like a... Could be this. That doesn't look that good. BR orange. Does that, that, does that look like wood? That looks, yeah, that looks like wood. Okay, that look, yeah, okay. That's as good as we can get it. So that's our wood. And we can put that back into objects. And now we can run it and see if it works. We also need to make it so that it appears once you actually start building, but if we change it to wood, it works. And you can actually build with the wood, and we can change it back to dirt, and that works. Yay! I've, I've never actually had a project where it works first try, so this is very exciting for me. I am still uh, um, good at coding. <laughs> Nonetheless, I am still good at coding. <laughs> just, just because I have a lot of errors doesn't mean that um, I'm not good at coding, but... This is so cool. I can I can build. I can change to wood if I want to make it look better. Okay, well, I tried drag clicking, but it didn't really work that well. But now that we have all of that done, um, we actually need to make it so, oops, I'm just closing everything. Now we just need to make it so when you equip it, it actually um, like makes the uh, thing appear. So we can just make it disappear for now. Uh, so visible, visible, visible. Okay, there we go. And here we can just say player, our uh, head caps lock on player dot player. GUI dot um uh, build dot um scrolling frame dot vis uh, visible is equal to true and then since that was that took me like a while I'm just gonna copy that then here we can just say that and False. Okay. Now that should work. So that works. And then I'm pretty sure it saves it. So if I turn it off and turn it back, yeah, it should save it. Yep. Okay. It works. Okay. Uh, I'll see you in the next one. And bye, guys.